Welcome back to Parental Discretion. You know, it can be hard to get your family to do what you want them to do, but what if you got people to sign a petition to support your cause? We had our correspondent, Andrea Wada Davies, go undercover to find out. Excuse me, can I talk to you guys for a second? No? Pregnant woman needs petition signatures. So this is a petition to make kid-sized washer and dryers so that they'll do their own damn laundry. What? Yeah. It's just like little bitty versions of it. Is that a safety hazard? No, they'll be kid-friendly. For like three or four-year-olds. Yeah, 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 yeah. They need to learn to do their own laundry. Do you mind oh, signing? Yeah. yeah, I mean, they get it dirty, they can clean it. Thank you. Hi, oh, you're very welcome. Excuse me, can you guys sign my petition? I'm almost done. I need two more signatures. What is it for? It's to get coffee shops to make kid-sized cappuccinos. Seriously, my little four-year-old loves cappuccinos, but the adult size is a little too big. They just don't cater to kids, especially five and under. Caffeine is really good for kids. Yeah, it gives them a better personality. Can I get you to sign a petition for me? Well, my daughter and I made a deal that if I got 100 signatures, she'd stop drinking soda. She drinks a lot of soda, like eight, eight glasses a day. How old is she? She's five. Oh no! How much soda I'll should she drink? Over. She shouldn't be drinking any. Why would anybody give a five-year-old soda? Because it's tasty and it gives her energy. Your Bingo. daughter's going to have serious medical issues. Well, I guess I'll have to deal with that later. My son seems to handle it okay. Well, You're I mean, <laughs> actually, I think that they are lucky to have You're me as a mom. No, they're lucky. <laughs> it's a petition to ban sex in hotel rooms. I'm a mom and I take my kids on vacation all the time and we stay in hotel rooms mm -hmm. and it's, sometimes my kids stick to the beds and I'm tired of it and I'm tired of hearing the guests next door have, having sex. Your, your kids stick to the bed? Yeah. Have you ever put a black light up to the, to the beds? I have. And you put a black light up to the bed, ceiling, wall, carpet, TV, what? everywhere. It's disgusting. It's disgusting. So I just want to make it more sanitary. Do you mind? Yeah. Thanks. Have you guys heard people having sex next door when you stay at a hotel yeah. room? Yeah. Do you think hotel rooms are gross and unsanitary? Yeah. I basically created a petition to ban sex in all hotel rooms. It grosses me out. Yeah, it's true. I yeah. see stuff on the ceiling, on Do the you walls. Want me to sign your petition? Do you mind? Oh, no. I, I hope you don't take this the wrong way, but a, certain people will think it's pretty ironic that your petition's about not having sex and you're pregnant. I love to have sex. <laughs> I got pregnant in the back of a car. So oh, it's cool. Like so in that's cars. Okay. That's yeah. in cars. Don't you hear people in hotel rooms having sex? Oh, it's like, gross. Eh, 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 eh. Man, if it's banned, I'll not. It's because of you. Yeah. Good on ya. Excuse me, would you sign a petition to get my husband to stop telling me to lose weight? I'm pregnant. He's so judgmental. He needs to stop telling me to lose weight. Are you serious? Yeah. If I get a thousand signatures and he said he'll stop. What? He keeps telling me I need to lose weight. And you're pregnant? He's embarrassed lose to weight. be seen with me. If that's your husband, you guys need some counsel. But I love him. You have to wake up, honey. But I do want to look skinnier for him. That's not love. Well, you have a baby. And I mean, you he, need he goes out and he gets me ice cream, and then he yells at me for oh, eating it. You don't have to Thank prove you. anything to anybody. He oh. said if I get a thousand signatures, he'll buy me a new car. I really want a new no, no, car. No, no, I'm gonna give you something. I want you to call this number, and you and your husband go to them. Take your husband there, and if you I, wait, hold not, on, hold on. I feel badly, really badly, because you're so sweet, no. and everything you've been saying is so sincere. But on your own, hidden camera. Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> it's parental discretion oh. for Nick Mall. Oh. And <laughs> Andrew Wada Davies, everybody. All right, now let's go back live to the World Kegel Championships in Helsinki.